The Teacher Connect program is actually a national gem. It is a program that was created in South Carolina in the 1980s designed to attract students academically talented students to the teaching profession. Uh, as a matter of fact, when the program first began in South Carolina, we did not realize that it was going to explode, that there was going to be an explosion in an interest across the nation uh, regarding a program that was designed to get students interested in the profession, and that's exactly what it has done. Teacher Cadet is a program for students who want to explore the profession of teaching, but not just who are interested in being teachers. And what I tell students all the time is that it's a program and a course that's going to make you a better human being. It's a course that will give you experiences in dealing with other people, learning about growth and development, learning about the psychology of learning, things that are going to make you a better learner, empower you to be a better learner yourself. And we are all in professions of working with or helping or teaching somebody to do something. Even if you're going to just want to be a better parent when it's your turn. Or if you're going to want to coach a little league team. Or if you're going to want to teach a Sunday school class. Or you have younger siblings or you want to babysit. Any of those kinds of skills are things that you learn, improve, and become good at through Teacher Cadet. Teacher Cadets is a really good way to expose students to the world of education and what it's actually like to be a teacher. It gives students the experience of being in the classroom if they're planning on being a teacher in the future. However, even if you're not planning on being a teacher, you can take something from Teacher Cadets. You learn interpersonal skills, um, and really it just betters you as a person. In Teacher Cadets, first we're in class and we learn about how to be a teacher and not just how to be a teacher but to work with kids. And from there we go on and we go into field experience and we actually get to go into the classroom and work with teachers and work with students and really get to see, you know, is this what I want to do and is this how I want to live my life? And it's a really great class. There are very few classes in a high school setting that are going to give you college credit and AP weighting as far as your GPA. Very few electives that give you that advantage. So you can walk away from high school with three hours of college credit, a boost in your grade point average from taking a class and become a better human being. That is a win-win-win. There's no reason not to take this class. I took teacher cadets because I've uh, considered becoming a teacher but also I heard that it was just a really good class to learn about how to uh, work with other people, especially children. I want to be a special ed teacher and so it was good to take the class and get ready for being a special ed teacher and um, it looks good on your college application. I took the class because it'll help me figure out if I want to actually teach later on. Um, it'll help me figure out what exactly I want to do and what I'm good at and if I'm good at teaching and being with other people. So just really to figure out what I actually want to do when I get to college and what I want to major in and everything. We know that the Teacher Cadet program is already improving public education, not only in South Carolina, but abroad as well. Uh, what the program does is to get those students who are academically talented, interested in the teaching profession, but not only does it do that, for those students who aren't even remotely interested in education, it's sort of piques their interest in the profession. Um, just like me, I'm a product of the Teacher Cadet Program, and when I began, when I took the course, I had no inclination whatsoever to become a teacher. Actually, ever since middle school, I knew that I wanted to go into corporate law, and that's what I was going to do. But as a result of the program, going into the clinical and doing that field experience, that is what sealed the deal for me. I was able to realize that I had a passion for something else, a stronger passion for teaching. The program will definitely change the minds of some students and we will know or realize our passion and become teachers. But for others, those that won't even step into the classroom though, there is a secondary purpose behind the Teacher Cadet Program. And that purpose is to get them to understand and be public advocates uh, for education, for the education profession. So even though some of them will never step into the classroom, they will be become better public advocates and citizens because of the program. Um, it really teaches me personally how to go out and work with, kid, work with kids and then work with adults so that I end up with good experience in both fields and I can 
you know, it's, it's not limited to just teaching. I can go out to pediatric nursing, or I can go out to, um, you know, being a daycare person. I can, there's so much I can do with this class. I think it's just helping a lot with learning what it takes to be a teacher because some people think that teaching, oh, it's easy, it's easy to do, but there's a lot that goes into it, a lot that goes into teaching the lessons, a lot that goes into preparing the lessons. So it shows you how much you have to be prepared for before you go out into the job field and stuff. Um, this class is preparing me for my future in many ways. It's just helped me understand that not everyone processes things at uh, you know the same rate, and that you know not everyone gets certain things. But you have to be able to adjust and be able to personalize depending on the person you're interacting with. So often uh, when I go and speak to teacher cadets and other students that are interested in education, I tell them that. In South Carolina, we definitely want to attract the best and brightest. That is the purpose, that's the mission of the Teacher Cadet Program. If you think about it, why shouldn't we want the best and the brightest? Um, my pitch to them is often this. When you are going to select someone to cut and style your hair, you want the best that there is. When you are going to select an attorney to represent you, of course, you're going to select the best and the brightest. If you're going to select a physician you know, to heal you, and take care of you, you want the best and brightest. So why shouldn't we want the best and brightest students to become teachers? Our teachers are going to shape and mold our society and our communities. We definitely want the best and brightest in, in our classrooms teaching our students. I'd say that it's a really great class. It's a lot of fun and you can go to any of the kids in your class because when you're in this class it's like being in a family and everybody is just really close together and um, you get free AP credit which is great and it's just good especially if you want to be a teacher but not only if you want to be a teacher it just helps you be prepared to have good study habits or know how to deal with situations in anything really. Well I would definitely say do it because it's a fun amazing class I mean it's, it's more it's different than outside the normal classroom setting because it's you know normal classroom setting you're sitting there learning about things but this is more of a hands-on learning you get to do things and to learn you get to hear music you get to do these observation days you get to it's just awesome it's, and it takes you outside the classroom you become not more than a class but you become a a learning family so to speak that you learn together you create bonds that you would never have thought would come out of class take it definitely take it because if you don't like it it'll be it'll help you later on in your future so you don't have as many questions about what you want to do um, and it's just a lot of fun you learn a lot you like meet a lot of new people you learn a lot of things you eat a lot of food it's just it's a lot of fun I tell them it's a great class the teacher Ms. Jackson is an awesome teacher she teaches you how to teach with not just your mind but or learn with not just your mind but with your heart we grow this thing called a teacher heart and it's like um, teaches us how to think like a teacher and how to feel like a teacher as well how to um, know when kids need help how they need help and how to connect with them personally I love teaching a class that students love coming to I teach English and not every student that comes into my English classroom loves to read great novels or discuss poetry nobody hates coming to teacher cadet and cadets tell you all the time that, that this is my very favorite class. This class has changed my life. Um, I love seeing former cadets who are now teaching in their classrooms and I love hearing from them. There's a relationship that you build from teacher to student in a teacher cadet class. You simply cannot build in a core academic area. So if you're a student who wants to have that kind of community building with other students you might not have known, get to know a teacher in a, a deeper kind of connected way other than just listening to that content and having an experience that is going to change your world for that year and beyond, then th that's what I get out of Teacher Cadet. They can find out more about the program by their high school's Teacher Cadet program. They could go to their high school Teacher Cadet instructor or their high school guidance office or they can contact us at Sarah at www.sarah.org or definitely go to www.teachercadets.com on our webpage. Everybody has potential to be a great person and Teacher Cadets really emphasizes that.